Lost Souls fans, it's Matt here with another unboxing. Today we are looking at a new War Machine uh, figurine that we got for uh, the Judicator or Revelator. Yeah, zoom in a little bit, how's that? Uh, Manoth, Protector to Manoth, Judicator or Revelator. Uh, you'll be, it, it just got the one model in here, you'll be able to to design it as, I'm trying to <laughs> fix the glare. You'll be able to design it uh, however you want. So, uh, there you go. There's your two styles that you could do. Uh, so let's, let's get this thing open. So, here we go. Getting this open. Alright, so. Nice, neat packaging. Although it's a little stuck on the side there. There we go. Okay. We got that. We got base. There we go. Nice big base. And of course, our assembly instructions. Uh, yeah. So as I said, the the kit itself is is either the Judicator or the Revelator. Uh, perhaps uh, the more Crafty amongst you could uh, magnetize some of the bits to try to make it, uh, you know, modular and interchangeable, but I think it'd be tough, but you're welcome to try. <laughs> there you go. That's that. But that is not the interesting part, I think. All right, so this is all, you know, this is all taped up nice and careful, so let's just, let's cut this open, there we go, hey. <laughs> this is thick plastic, they're being real, real careful here, yeah, get, get this a little more, I have to cut myself, bleed all, all, all over our new judicator, Ooh, there we go. There we go. Gotta find that seam. Okay. And slide it out. Oops. Oops. Trying to be careful. There we go. Plastic on. Alright, and then. <laughs> All the sprues are taped together. You know what? This is actually. <laughs> I do not joke around here. Oh, we already got one piece popped off. Probably. Sorry, I'm trying to get that plastic off. Okay, there we go. Let's just look at these one at a time. Zoom in a bit here. Yeah. Shuffle these off a little bit more so we can really just focus on each one. There we go. Now, I am no expert model builder. I'm not going to try to really identify each part, but uh, they look pretty nice so far. Like, uh, like the detail work, especially uh, over here. That's real nice. There we go. One out of eight sprues, I think. And then we just got that random piece. Set that off to the side. So far, Ooh, get that more out of the way. Off camera. There we go. Some more. Yeah, I'll get my hand out of the way. about War Machine, but uh, I've seen the models, and uh, I like them a lot, and uh, as I understand it, uh, there has not been a, pl 
plastic, uh, you know, judicator, revelator model. This, this is 100% plastic, <clears throat> uh, no resin at all. So uh, I know some people are very uh, particular about not having resin. So you'll be, you'll be glad to know that is uh, not the case. 100% plastic, nice, lightweight, sturdy. There you go. Yeah, definitely a lot, of, uh, a lot of options here as well, it looks like. We are about <laughs> not even halfway through of all these sprues. So there you go. Still more pieces. Oh, foot. Good for stomping. Yeah, it's it's so weird. See, like you'll you'll see this on here and be like, oh, is that a is that a shoulder? What's what's going on there? And then you hold it sideways, like, oh, obviously. <laughs> I have enough trouble assembling IKEA furniture. I don't need to be getting into any models this complex. At least not yet. Maybe one day. But so far, I like my uh, pre-built ones. It's fun though, I've, I've built models. It's fun, I do like it a lot. I'm just not great at it. There you go. A little extra bits down there. Okay, a few more left. There you go, some Steam vents, or the like, and a couple more pieces there. Yeah, a lot of a lot of pieces that you'll get to uh, like, you know, uh, just for aesthetic flair <laughs> or what have you. Which is uh, which is nice, you know, when throw in a couple extra bits just for you know uh, emblems, icons, sigils, whatever word you want to use for that iconography. So there you go. And uh, oh, all right. Uh, penultimate sprue here. I'm gonna try to give a little more angle on them because these do uh, pop out of the sprue a lot more than <clears throat> some others I've seen in the past. There you go. Now this is quite the war machine, which is. Definitely, at least mildly intended pun. <laughs> and this is it. This is our last one. So there you go. Just a quick little unboxing here for our uh, Judicator Revelator. There you go. We'll get one more look here. Zoom in on this to see... Uh, so they recommend a couple few changes there, and then it is only probably a lot easier than it looks, <laughs> despite all the steps. So there you go. There's that. The other side is just a single page, double-sided, folded. There you go. And then again, big old base. So there you go. That was our uh, War Machine Protector of Manoth Judicator Revelator Colossal Warjack Pack. Uh, all plastic, no resin. Uh, brought to you by Privateer Press. I uh, hope you had a good day. Thanks. Oh.